Balenciaga is selling the IKEA tote for $2,145. This really puts perspective into what happens when you slap a brand name onto something. A bag that looks like it came straight from IKEA has just received a high fashion upgrade by Balenciaga. The bag itself is made from glazed leather with hints of gold, costing a whopping $2,145, a far stretch when you compare it to a similar looking product that costs 99 cents. An IKEA spokesperson sounded quite happy stating, We are deeply flattered that the Balenciaga tote bag resembles the IKEA iconic sustainable blue bag for 99 cents. Nothing beats the versatility of a great big blue bag. People have been wondering if the more expensive one is just as good, considering that IKEA's blue bag can hold nearly 50 liters of water with ease. Van driver tricks Chinese traffic cops by drawing his own parking spot. Finding a parking spot can be a pain in any city, but a driver in eastern China has come up with a novel idea to get around the problem. He paints one himself. Local traffic cops had noticed the strange markings while on patrol. Compared with legitimate lines, the chalked ones were too thin and incomplete. Surveillance video later obtained by police shows a goods van parked on the side of the road on Monday afternoon. Later, a man wearing an orange shirt gets out of the van and appears to be drawing something on the road. The van was parked in the same spot for four days. The man has been identified and now has to pay a fine between $72 to $722. Homeless people handed free beer as part of Bud Light campaign. Bewildered shoppers watched a Bud Light 4x4 park up beside a subway in Whitechapel. The staff gifted cans of Lager to passersby as part of a promotional campaign. The vehicle was quickly told to move by one of the council staff because they did not have any permission to be there. There were a number of rough sleepers in the area who were excited of the event. One rough sleeper said that he was given quite a few cans and handed some of those out to his friends. He said they were just handing them out to everyone and ended with a trolley full. American Beer Bud Light has reappeared in the UK this year, 2017, 16 years after failing to make the product to take off. The light beer, which went on sale in February, has a much lower ABV than normal Budweiser as well as less calories. But city centre councillor Nick Small took a dimmer view of the marketing campaign, describing the actions of Anheuser Busch, the company behind Bud Light, as irresponsible, aggressive, and wrong. Constipated man shoved an eel up his bum. Doctors removed an eel from a man in China who was afflicted with stomach pains. The man inserted the creature into his anus in a futile attempt to unblock his intestines. After realizing he made things worse, he went to seek medical treatment. The 49-year-old man initially visited the hospital earlier that week due to his excruciating stomach pains, informing doctors that he had a significant blockage in his bowels. The doctors advised him to remain in the hospital for treatment, but the man refused to wait and decided to take matters into his own hands by inserting a 50-centimeter long live eel into his bum. He was under the impression that eels could be used to alleviate constipation according to old medicinal practice. The treatment, however, had the opposite effect and made things much worse. After being rushed to the hospital, the surgeons extracted the 8-ounce eel and the remains of his bowel blockage.